Greetings out there in YouTube land. Greetings from the planet Earth to all you out there. Now I'm having a beautiful day. I tell you, I'm feeling awesome. Oh, the world road really rocks, man. Considering about a week ago, you know, close enough, right? Because I'm 12, so about six days ago, I was sicker than a dog. I tell you, brothers and sisters out there, I was wearing fly pills with the nitro patches just to stay alive. Uh, with the odd spray and a pump. This is one person, and you know, 24 7, right? And the Lord tapped me on the shoulder. Woof! I tell you, I'm trying to get right with God, you know, because I, I don't know, I was messing around. This man right here, I love this man. Uh, I can see the God moving him. They asked a really good question. He's got many short videos. Some of them really low, like two minutes, but they, oh, they hit the hammer and nail, you know, perfect, right? And what will God say to you? Now, that's a good question we all need to ask ourselves. And I got him on the screen right here. This guy, Robert, he rocks, man, you know. I, I like him, right? He's from Australia. I'd love to meet that man one day. I tell you, he's great, you know. And I'd play it for you if I could. I just don't know about this copyright garbage. I don't want any of that, right? But I like this man. And, you know, and, and I tell you, you know, God healed me. I know that may not mean much to you people, right? For you, it's nothing. But when you're falling all the, down all the time, and you don't even know my story. I, I was having like 20, 30 heart attacks a day. It seemed like, well, you know, every time you turn around, it's falling down. There's that many. You, you lose count, right? And we're not looking at babies. And the fact that God spared me, showed me love and mercy, even though I didn't, uh, I didn't do anything to deserve it. Come on. Everybody knows our best works is a filthy rags to them. But they forget that God's looking down and he doesn't see a righteous person on the planet. But I think you might see one of that man right there on that screen. I like him a lot. I watched a bunch of my God in my playlists, right? And this is after I, I got healed here by God, right? Because I really noticed a bunch of things because it bothered me before about a lot of the fake Christians out there really messing me up, you know, with their attitudes like they know anything. And they didn't even know the God I was talking to. And apparently, uh, he likes me good enough that I got healed because he, see, he sees that I'm repentant of heart and I'm doing my best, you know. But I tried to talk to a few in some Christian chats about my God who's been doing this wondrous things for me, a miracle after miracle, even though I didn't deserve it. And they're all poo-pooing it, yeah, yeah, whatever. And they're going on their holy high host and don't even know the garbage that they're talking to. And they have no idea how much it offends me because I've got, I really got a personal relationship with my God. Now this man right here, he's worth a trip to see for me personally. And I think I'm going to see him one day, real soon. I'm going to work on that because he's a real man of God as far as I see it. I mean, I, I just, you know, up to you if you like it, right? But take it from a man who God decided to spare and give a lifetime to, who was supposed to die any day and actually was 12 years past due for the grave, you know? So they told me I had a week to live. Well, I told them only God decides whether I live or die and guess who's still here? And you can do the math. My God is real. He loves you. So repent of your wicked ways and he will forgive you and he'll never leave you alone. God bless and have a great day. Remember, God is real and he loves you. Bye-bye.